In this video, we're going to go over how to set up your SKU Grid settings for the eBay Marketplace. When you're logged into SKU Grid, the first thing you'll do is click on Settings, and then you'll click on the eBay button. From here, you will have the ability to choose the eBay platform that you are selling on. All of these are different countries that eBay does business. Currently, SKU Grid operates and functions with the United States or UK for United Kingdom. The other countries will be added later, so for right now, you'll choose either the U.S. or U.K. platform. The first thing that you'll do when you come to this screen, you'll notice that the platform says eBay USA or eBay U.K. The first thing you'll do is click where it says get your keys. You click this link that says here. And it tells you, you are being directed, all unsaved settings will be lost. Click OK. You'll arrive at this screen. The next step is to, it says, please click here to be redirected to eBay for authentication. You'll click this link. A new tab will open. You will log into your eBay account. When you're logged into your eBay account, SKUGrid is asking eBay, is asking for your permission to authorize SKUGrid to make changes in your eBay account. So all you do is read this little authorization here and click I agree. When you're done, it will tell you that you can close this window. So you'll just close this tab. I'm not going to go through this whole process because my keys have already been generated. But you'll simply click I agree and follow the rest of the prompts on the screen. You'll close this tab. When you do, you'll return here. It says, are you done? You click here to check your settings. And then you'll click the eBay button again and click the platform that you just logged into. So in this case, US. When you return to the eBay marketplace that you selected, you'll notice that the keys for your eBay application ID, your eBay certificate ID, eBay developer key, eBay authentication token, they've all been filled in for you.